Beach here. Jason Witten hosts his pro camp where dreams come true for young athletes who get to play side by side with one of their favorite Dallas Cowboys. But for one kid here today, an even bigger wish is coming true. If you walk into Brayden's room, he has one of these life size posters or whatever they call them of Jason Witten. He may be number 82 on the Dallas Cowboys roster. But for Braden, Jason Witten is number one. Why is he your favorite player? What do you like about him? Um, he's really good and nice, and I just really like him. So you could say it's Braden's lucky day. Well, the excitement was awesome. He really didn't sleep all night. Jumped up this morning, wanted to get going. Because today is the kickoff of the NFL Players Annual Pro Camp, and a chance for Braden to take the field with his idol. We are thrilled, we're at Grand Prairie High School. We have about 300 kids out here. Jason, his brother, and he makes sure that he interacts with every child. So they're also getting a star studded event, if you will, really getting to interact and learn from Jason himself. I'm really excited because Jason Wynn is my favorite football player and I like football. But today's excitement carries even farther than that, considering a few months ago, the closest place to a football field he would have been is the sideline. Well, last year, Braden was diagnosed with a, a rare blood disease. It was called HLH, is the diagnosis, and he was, it's a uh, blood disease that's fatal. With the odds against him, the seven-year-old put his game face on, tackling his disease and coming out on top. He went through some, uh, I don't know, three, two or three months worth of treatments. I uh, didn't know if he was going to make it through it. Uh, we, uh, I mean, it's, it's kind of hard for me. To, oh. But anyway, we, you know, we, we, he worked through it. He went through chemo. They actually tore his body down and built it back up. Which means today, Brayden is back where he belongs. Um, I was sick for a while. I was really excited so I could come do this today. Uh, a year ago, he couldn't get out of bed. Today, he's playing baseball, he's playing soccer, football. Uh, looks like a totally different kid. Uh, he has his energy back. It's, um, it's a miracle. And as this camp comes to an end, another miracle is about to take place. You told us you had a special wish that you wanted to do, right? What was that wish? Go to the Super Bowl. Go to the Super Bowl, but not any Super Bowl, because you could have gone to this past one, right? You wanted a warm weather Super Bowl, right? So this next Super Bowl is Super Bowl um, 49, I believe, and your wish is coming true. We thought this would be the perfect place with your favorite player here to reveal that your wish is going to come true. So you're going to go. And this will do for the time being until we get your real ticket, but this is Braden's ticket to go to Super Bowl. Nice. All right, thank you. Hopefully I'm playing, but if I'm not, I get to go And Braden's wish granted by his favorite football player is a touchdown in this young athlete's book. It felt really good, and I just was really happy. His dream came true thanks to the Make-A-Wish Foundation, who's been Braden's quarterback every step of the way. They just, they've gone through so much, this is a chance for them just to relax and, you know, breathe and forget about everything that they were going through. I think what they do for kids is it's inspiring. They give kids hope. They give them, they give kids the uh, the identity to, to actually fulfill their dream. Why is this something that you've always wanted to do? Why did you pick this for your wish? Because I like football and I want to be an NFL football player, so I want to go to the Super Bowl. Although he has a few years to go before he can take the tight end spot, where he is now is a moment worth holding on to. He went through a whole, whole lot and uh, had some really bad times, but today we'll, he'll never forget. 